Hi, I'm Mark Jenkins, 2004 Athens Olympian and professional triathlete. In these videos, we're looking at preparing for open water swimming with Speedo. We're going to look at deep water starts for the swim portion of your triathlon. As you're preparing for the gun to go, if you can lie flat on the surface, treading water with your hands and slightly kicking your legs, so you're already in a position to start swimming. So that when the gun goes, you're instantly ready to pull with both arms and kick with your legs, hopefully getting away from any other competitors that might be around you very quickly. Here we are with Steve in the pool and Steve's going to demonstrate sighting. Obviously in the pool there's not as much chop as there is in open water, so for Steve to sight he doesn't have to raise his head as high as you'll necessarily need to when you're in a more choppy environment. As Steve swims he takes a stroke, he lifts his head up, looks where he's going, puts it back in and carries on swimming. What I'd suggest you do in the ocean or in a lake or wherever you are in the open water is you lift your head up maybe a little bit higher so you can actually see the buoy or see where you need to be going. Here we are practicing turns. As Lois approaches the buoy, she has a quick look at where she's going. She takes mainly strokes the left arm while keeping her right arm still. Uh, the reason for doing that is so that it doesn't get tangled up in the buoy and she's not hitting it on the way around. Another technique that Lois can use when she's turning the boy is she turns on her back and she uses one arm to pull around the boy and then the other arm to pull around again. So you're getting more momentum turning by using a rolling technique. Although the main topic of these videos is open water swimming, a number of early season races actually use pools for the swim because the open water is too cold. So if you are going to do a pool based triathlon then it might be handy to learn how to do a tumble turn. The basic principle of a tumble turn is a half somersault against the wall in which you go in with your hands first and obviously you end up with your feet against the wall. It's good to practice this in the middle of the pool so you obviously don't hit your heels against the wall while practicing them. So if you practice a half flip and pretend to push off the wall and then when you get more confident at doing this then you can practice it at the wall and the same as everything else, practice makes perfect. Main thing to remember, don't panic. Just roll onto your back, keep kicking your legs, adjust them, turn back onto your front, keep swimming. And it literally is as simple as that. Now we're on to your favorite part of the open water swim, getting out. So as you exit the water, just again, stay calm, try and get your wits about you. It is, it is disorientating when you take your first few steps from standing up. So don't rush it, just relax, get your legs through, stand up, take your wetsuit off, just get on with your day. So today we've covered the swim tips at our local Virgin Active. Remember the swim is the start of your triathlon day. So stay relaxed and enjoy the experience. Mm -hmm.